morning morning sir let me find Good out morning, let me look for the file that we i have used yesterday <clears throat> Uh, I'm looking for the file that we have used yesterday. Okay, now here I found it. Yes. Let's begin. We started with direct indirect speech yesterday. So let's continue. Are you able to see the screen? The word file? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes. I guess this is the same sentence that we have started yesterday. Rule number one. Now, if you want to, you can sit with exercise book as well. Note, make a note of it. If the reporting verb, which one is the reporting verb here in the sentence? Said is the reporting verb. If the reporting verb is said is followed by and by its object. Like, which one is object here? This is an object. This said is a reporting verb. This is an object of reporting verb, object of reporting verb. And then yesterday I told you to look after the pronoun. I is the pronoun. And then tense of the sentence and then adverb. This is adverb, this is adverb, tense of the sentence. You have to look at the tense of the sentence while changing direct to indirect. Then pronoun, change in pronoun, then Object of reporting verb. Then reporting verb and its tense. Not only reporting verb, but you have to look at reporting verb and the tense of the reporting verb. These are the things that you have to take into account while changing direct to indirect. And sometimes, the type of sentence in direct speech. The type of sentence in direct speech. Sentence type.
one, two, three, four, five, six things that you have to look. Reporting verb and its tense, object, whether reporting verb is followed by object or not, tense of the sentence, pronoun, and sentence type, what kind of sentence is it, and adverb. Now, the first rule is, there are no first and second anyway, but let's start on our own. If the reporting verb is followed by its object, said changes into told, the reporting verb said changes into told, Example, like in the sentence above, he said to me, I have written a letter today. He told you, please pay attention and copy all the examples, okay? One after the other. He told me that, now I pronounce changes into he. He told me that he had, return a letter that day and we'll come to why had written why that day later on one by one in our rule now it is not necessary that said always changes into told but whether said remains told or not is again determined by the type of the sentence in direct speech like if the sentence is let's say said the reporting verb the reporting verb may change into told asked inquired questioned or bed etc. Determined by the type of the sentence in direct speech. Now it may it may change into told or it may change, it may remain said or it may change into asked determined by the kind of the sentence in direct speech. Example, He said to me, what is your name? Now, this said may not uh, always change into told, but as we have said, it's determined by the kind of the sentence in direct speech because the sentence in direct speech is interrogative, question sentence. So it changes into something like this. He told, he asked me what my name was. Number three. All the different kinds of sentences in direct speech change into a sentence that ends in full stop to be easy. Make you easy that ends in full stop or a uh, step. Now in the above example number two, you have seen what is your name is a question sentence, but in our indirect speech, it changes into what my name was, change according to the tense, change in the tense, and it changes into just to, there are different kinds of sentences. Command, order, request, question and they all changes into a statement that ends in full stop. Not what was my name, but what my name was full stop.
number four. And sometimes you will be asked questions based on this number, number four. If the RV reporting valve is in present or especially simple, simple present tense or present perfect tense, if it is in simple future tense, then the tense of the direct speech. Direct speech means the sentence within inverted. The tense of the direct speech remains as it is. If the reporting verb is in simple present tense, present perfect tense, or simple future tense, then the tense of the direct speech remains as it is. For example, he says to, he says to me, he says to me, he tells me, Sorry. Just to, if the sent, if the reporting verb is like says, tells, tell, say, will say, shall say, has said, have said. then the tense of the direct speech remains the same. He says to me. He says to me, I've written a letter. He says me that he has written a letter. Have written, present perfect. Has written present perfect. Says changes into told why. As a rule, if said, if reporting verb said is followed by object, object of reporting verb, said changes into told as we have discussed in first rule. Similarly, if the reporting verb followed by by Object then tells changes the reporting verb by its object, then it changes into sorry. This is important.
बुझियो यो बने को if reporting verb said is followed by object said changes into told if reporting verb says if the reporting verb appears in present tense and is followed by an object then it changes into tells said told says tells followed by object yes, sorry yes a i d plus o r b object of reporting verb t o l d not always but that again is determined by determined by the type of sentence in direct speech said changes into told but that again is determined by the kind of the sentence in direct speech and if says reporting verb followed by object object of reporting verb it changes into tells eti bujiyo now revise once again एकचोटि सर पढ़ने कुछ बुझेन आस्क मी फ्रम वन टू फोर एंड रिमेम्बर द क्वेश्चन विल अलवेज बी आस्क फ्रम व्हाट वी हेव रेड हमें जे पढ़ते मध्य क्वेश्चन आँच बाहर बार आ If you are using a laptop, do you know how to take a screenshot? Yes, sir, we know. Okay, you you can use the sniping tool. if reporting verb is in simple present tense present perfect tense or simple future tense no change in the tense of the sentence in direct speech next if the sentence in direct speech states facts truths or you may call it universal facts then we don't in the tense of the direct speech or the tense of the direct speech tense of the sentence in direct speech remains unchanged example if the sentence in direct speech states facts truths or universal facts truths we don't change the tense of the direct speech or it remains unchanged example he said to me human blood is red he told me that 
Human blood is red. What is more important is you understand what you are copying rather than you copying, rather than you copy first, sorry. Rather than you copy, you understand what you are copying. If the sentence in direct speech states facts, truths, universal facts, we don't change the tense of the direct speech. I'll explain what I'm writing. If reporting verb is in past tense, reporting verb is in past tense in all the sentences. If reporting verb is in past tense, Sabayma. And if the sentence in direct speech is in simple present, then if the sentence, the rule for the change of the tense of the sentence in direct speech to indirect while changing direct to indirect. So my reporting verb past tense. First check if the reporting verb is in past tense or not. Say, said, told, asked, whatever. 
then we change the tense of the sentence in direct speech. If the sentence in direct speech is in present tense, change into corresponding past tense, simple past. If the sentence is in present perfect, we change it into past perfect. If the sentence is in present continuous, we change it into past continuous. If the sentence is in present perfect continuous, we change it into past perfect continuous. And if the sentence is in simple past, we change it into past perfect. If the sentence is in past perfect, no change, we keep it as it is. If the sentence is in past continuous, we change it into past perfect continuous. If the sentence is in past perfect continuous, then we keep past perfect continuous, no change. Only these two, simple past changes into past perfect, past continuous changes into past perfect continuous. The reporting verb has to be in past tense in all the sentences. Can changes into good, will changes into good, shall changes into should, must changes into had to. May changes into might. He said to me, you must go there, you must do it. He told me that I had to do that. just have a look have a close look on the rule of the tense change while changing sentences from direct to indirect number eight no change Number six, no change. 
all the present sentences in present tenses in their corresponding past tenses. Has everyone understood this number six? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let's revise the rules from one to four, five first. Like the Ferry era. I will today send some questions for you to practice as well. I will send in Sagar's messenger in the form of the photo, so he will share it to you. Sagar, will you? Yes, sir. Okay, let me take a question or photo you can practice as well after the lesson is over. Now, number seven. If the sentence in direct speech consists of yes, no question, then we replace that conjunction that in indirect speech with if or whether example He said to me, do you like coffee? He asked me if or whether Jun Lehebani unsa when you go to if slash whether lehola, don't do it. I mean either if or whether. He asked me if I liked coffee. And even while writing, don't ever write. Like if you are writing a letter or essay, don't write sentences like this. My father asked me if I liked 
coffee or not you dinan whereas we shall write Are these means reporting verbs? Now, the final one, rules for the change, rules for the change in adverbs or rule changing adverbs.
now then T H A N O ina. Ago changes into B four. Today, that day, let me take the help from the book so that I won't miss any. Today, that day. Tonight. That night, uh, here, there, this, that, these, those, come, go, come here, go there. Tomorrow, the next day, or or the following day, day should be there. Okay, the next day or the following day. Uh, Yesterday, the day before, next year, the following year, Etinatola. Last Saturday. Last Saturday. Last Saturday. Last means last. last. He said to me, I will meet you last Saturday. He told me that he would meet me last on last, last Saturday. Last go first of the Excuse me. Will you please repeat the question if you are asking me the question? THUS thus means? Sir, no. Thus means? So, so means so. Pardon? So? So. Mali Buzina. Can Lekata annotate Gara? You Esco Sura Heavenly Boyo? Just to?
यो बने को He said to me, thus we conclude the meeting. He told me that, thus they concluded the meeting, or he told me that, so they concluded the meeting. अब ऑप्शन में क्या आऊँ सर? Thus means in this way, more or less. अब तो thus बने को in this way पर नहीं आऊँ सर? डेरफोर भर्थ में लट प्रिड्स बिफोर यू यूज दैट वर्ड डिटरमाइंस व्हाट्स द मिनिंग अफ दैट वर्ड इन पर्टिकुलर लेट मी लुक फर सम अफ द क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू स्पीच ओके एक क्वेश्चन भी हो मसंग दिज अलमोस्ट दिज रूल्स आर सफिशिंट फर यू लेट मी figure out if i have got some questions chana ta chha kati chha kati chha aba ka chha ka chha I will write down the questions for you. You please copy the questions. I will select the questions from the book. Important questions. Copy these questions and write down the answers for practice.
this one is important number six. All are important anyway, but this is more important. Now answer these questions. Copy these questions and answer these. And we are going to end today's class only after we complete answering these. Have you completed copying the questions? No, sir.
I will share after you complete that. I will also share one file and uh, I would like you to go through it as well. I have PDF format of the text. First, try to answer these questions.
So yesterday's file, haven't you been able to get? Biosar Pathi. Biosar. I will send them again. I don't know whether the file, yesterday's file will be included or not. My desktop, my dairy file, sir. So I have here four or five rules. I will send all of these. I will change all these into PDF and send you one second. You saw the layer, any of your file. Biosar, sir. Biosar, sir. Biosar, sir. Biosar, sir. I, I will convert these. I have five. I'm working on five files. I'm converting these. I will send Sagar and you get it from Sagar. There are five files. The preposition co questions with answers are also there. Practice it for a time being. Go through them. file. If you go through them and read them, work on them, you will be benefited. If you don't do so, my effort will also be lost. My current will also be lost. Wi-Fi is also wasted. So many things wasted. Done. Exercise. Eleven of you, sir. Look, we'll go through the answers of this exercise yes, in our sir. next lesson. It's already nine five. Moyo file put hide in some file first. Wait for a time being. There are. I'm sending six files. Not five. So I hope all of you have copied those 15 questions and you will have enough time to revise and go through them. You can discuss with your friends online. R rather than getting the answers from the teacher, you get it, get the answers. If you don't know the, the answer of any question among yourself with discussion, that would be far better. And get your answer sheet ready by tomorrow. So in tomorrow's class, we'll start with checking those answers. I'll provide you the answers and you can check them on your own. Messenger is working. Drop me a, drop me a one line message or one word message in Messenger. Then you appear first. Will be easier for me. Mala messenger may have a message, but how the saga? Yes, sir. <laughs> 